Hello, and welcome to the first ever BPG podcast. I am joined by two of my three brilliant editors, uh, Semi, also formerly known as Laxar. Wait, who's Laxar? You. And we are also are joined you about? by Nathan Two, also known as Jordan. I want to be called Nathan Two. <laughs> okay, so uh, how do you start podcasts? I don't even know. Black Ops Four. <laughs> this game is is uh, it's in a state that to a point where I feel like I needed to make a podcast about it. Um, and I just want to start it with, I need the old perks back. Yeah, yeah, we do. Straight up. There's no denying that. There's no denying it. Straight up, I've always said it, that either storyline should have the old OG perks and gobblegums, because that's how it worked in Black Ops 3. And the new storyline, the Chaos storyline, should have the new systems, the the elixirs and, and the new perk system. I just feel like that would work better with the game. You're not the only one. Even Dempsey says that. There's like a quote where he says... Uh, oh, he preferred he the Perka sodas. I actually remember that. I'm, I'm no, sure. He, 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 he prefers like the jingles. The, the original jingles. <laughs> yes. Yeah, well, Dempsey doesn't even have a fourth wall to break. So, <laughs> let's, let's be honest. Like, has he ever had a fourth wall? I don't think he has. Maybe in like World of War or something. Yeah, when... Was he actually was he voiced by Steve Bloom in World of War or? I'll check it. I, I'm not even too sure if he was uh, still voiced by the same guy. But yeah, I feel like it's in a state. It's like I watched a Glitching Queen video earlier, um, and it was about DLC two, and there's a potential that there's going to be two new maps. Uh, one being Nuke Town and another being like a new Chaos map. I doubt it because I... they said there there'd be one D- zombies map per DLC. See, that's what I that is exactly what I thought, and I don't see why they'd release another two maps. Like we're not asking for maps, maps, maps. We're just asking for f- working maps. <laughs> we're asking for promotion. Mm. Marketing. Like. Another another reason why zombies is just getting less popular is because there is less promotion and people are not noticing the new things. Yeah, yeah. It's it's, it's actually... one just dropped out of nowhere. Yeah, no one knew about it. Exactly. Sort of. Here you go. Here's the game. People were like, "Oh, hey, uh, I, I'm 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 right now. I'm the next two weeks on vacation. I I, I can't I can't do this." <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, yeah. Dead of the Night. I honestly think it's a brilliant map, but. There was no marketing, and I think that just killed the hype completely for it. Like, Brian Blessed is in it. Okay, if you're not British, you don't appreciate that as much as a British person does. But straight up, Brian Blessed is one of the four people I said it back in February last year to put in a zombies map. Okay, I called it, and he he is, like, literally the best character on the map. I don't even care. Like, who's the other one? The Game of Thrones star. Like, who cares? I'm I'm sorry. But, like, no. Go away. (laughs) Brian Blessed. (laughs) End of. (laughs) Who's yeah. the game of Thrones star? I, I don't know the 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 detective guy. I'm pretty sure he's played by someone who was in Game of Thrones. Um... So, all right, someone's googling it. Yeah. Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> that's how you Google something. Okay, that's that's a nice keyboard, man. Uh, let's see, who's the detective? Uh, that's the gunslinger. Uh, that's a girl. It's just like every single map that's a girl. You no, know, that's the girl. Do you think? Do you think they're doing that because of like trying to be politically correct? Do you, do you actually think that might be a thing? Wait, there is no detective in that of tonight. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. No, okay, so it's not not the the brigadier. It's not Brian Blessed. It's not the girl. It's not. Oh, who do you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> he <destroyed>. Hello. <laughs> um. So you've got. You've got Brian Blessed, you've got the girl, you've got the butler, the other one. So not 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 none of those three, the other one to that. Wait, oh wait, so... Okay, the other one is... Like the cowboy. Yeah, 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 That's yeah, him. Kiefer Sutherland. Apparently he's in, in Game of Thrones, I'm pretty sure. I heard Lex say it on one of his streams. I'm like, uh, let's see, let's wait. see. He might have been in like an episode, but I don't think he was in for like a season. Hmm. 
something like that. I don't see Game of Thrones on this IMDb page. All I'm saying is Brian Blessed is still the best character <laughs> on the map. <laughs> and they all get killed at the end by a bottle. Yep. And then my girl Scarlet comes out of nowhere. Bam! He's gone. <laughs> He's gone. They're literally all dead. What was the point of the map? They're all dead. Am the point I right? of the map is what she's just like... I'm, I was saying, am I right in saying that like the party was hosted by Scarlet's father and then like they kidnap him? No, I I think the party was hosted by like the cults. Alistair through, Rhodes through through the uh, through Alistair Rhodes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, makes sense. Either that or he he hosted the party and then they got like they captured him or something. I'm <laughs> saying one of the one of the chances Scarlet actually gets to him and then he just dies like straight after. Him. <laughs> just gotta be one of them. Yeah. Oh, I don't. Just get shot in the head. <laughs> I, I do wonder when we all get a sequel to Nine, where they like, where someone goes and saves the the, uh, See, the main crew. I have a theory about Nine, and it's it's a weird one, but like I, I have a feeling that that could potentially be the last map in canon on Black Ops 4's Chaos storyline, just because they all die what? in it. Why and would it end with them all dying? That's think not, about such it. a stupid end to a story. Yeah, it is. I agree. But, like, it's 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 such a Treyarch thing to do, to try something new, realise it doesn't work, and then just kill it. Literally just why kill would, it. Why, <laughs> why would they realise that on the first... Oh, no, wait, that's the second map. Well, they've noticed... Like, surely, surely they've actually, got to have noticed how the community has declined. Like, surely. Everyone, everyone... Like, um, Access if 9 is the main map of Black Ops 4, but like the first map is Voyage. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Tank Lasagna. I don't like you, Voyage. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, honestly, honestly, I don't like Voyage. It's a hard map. It's too hard. Like, it's ridiculously hard. I think my I highest think it's like... is like 20. I've never done Pack a Punch. I, I don't it, understand it. It. It, it, would be, it would be good if the zombies have Black Ops 3 uh, mechanics. Again, that goes back to our first point, saying that they, they, they shouldn't have changed the perks. I, I saw an interview recently. I think no, it was no, 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 no. I'm talking about the zombies themselves, not the perks. Like the perks, okay, sure, but the zombies themselves have new mechanics, and these mechanics mm, are shite. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, you know what? Yeah, it makes it's sense, like a combination of of uh, Black Ops Three system that you can't jump over and zombies two anymore. As well. But but mm. like. No, but like, not just jumping, but you can't even walk around them without getting caught. And then, what a worse uh, mechanic where you get slowed down when you get hit. Oh mate, I hate that. That that that, that, that you've slowed me down to that so many times. I, I, it's that's ridiculous. why I always run Victoria's Tortoise and just run around with the shield in front of me. Wait, Tortoise? Yeah, I always run that. Tortoise. Yeah, my is really bad. Please kill me. Oh my god, that's amazing! Tortoise, I love that! How do you, how do you pronounce that? I pronounce it tortoise, 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 tortoise. Tortoise. But I, I am now gonna start saying tortoise. I love that. I love that so much. I need to translate it. Just like, what does translate <laughs> about this? See what Google says. Uh, let's see. Tortoise. Tortoise, that's that. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's, that's good. That's good. And why do I have it set to Russian? <laughs> English to Russian, why? Vodka! <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Yeah, but yeah, it's, it's, it's one of them. I, I don't know. I, I just hope with DLC 2, I, I mean, I can see it happening with this 115 day coming up in like two days. I can see them actually advertising DLC 2. Um, and and it, it might work out a lot better. But the thing is... Will it be enough to bring back the community? I, I don't I know. I don't think it will. I, I honestly don't know. Like, um, everyone's gone to separate ways, yeah. really, right now. Like, look at the zombies community. JC's gone and played, what, he's playing Resident Evil the other day. Noah's tweeted that he's going to do his own thing. Mm. I but, personally love what I'm doing myself. I, 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 I don't know. I, I've noticed as well. The thing is, with the zombies community, uh, did you see Milo's video? in the week about how like how it, it was about all the different creators doing things differently um and i think it was just a really good video uh and yeah i don't know i just yeah i really liked it <laughs> it was about like like you two say all the different 
creators going into different paths. Um, whereas some of the c zombies creators, such as Codine Pizza and Glitching Queen, are completely sticking to zombies and it, it's working out for them. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I like it. I mean, I think, I, honestly, I will make this statement right now. I think Mr. T Lexify is the most entertaining streamer on Twitch, like, regardless of what he plays. He's, he's just that full of energy and that. that uh, I, I mean, I don't know. I, it, it's almost. Oh, what's the, what's the word? It begins with O. Um, oh, it's a big word. <laughs> um, <laughs> like. Oh god, when you when you're really energetic and and it's it, it's a bad word, but it's it's it can be good. Ah, oh, ah, oh, bah, bah, I can't think of the word honestly. I, 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 it begins with O. Um, yeah, it's ah oh, man. Ah, oh. <laughs> I can't think of a word. Um, yeah, it's it's a uh, yeah. Anyway, yeah, Lex is the <laughs> most entertaining streamer on, on Twitch, like straight up. Um. I can't name anyone that's this bad anymore. Like I was watching his and JC's Rocket League stream, and uh, yeah, I, again, I couldn't. <laughs> it was it, I couldn't stop laughing. It was a great stream, um, and yeah, I don't know. I, like I say, I, I mean DLC two. I feel like it'll bring back a lot of the creators for like a week, um, and potentially some of them for even longer, because I feel like they're going to market it, and I feel like they're going to release trailers and they're going <laughs> to hype it up. Um, they they get... might, they might just do that. Like oh. looking at the feedback from DLC one, they might do it. Well, yeah, exactly. They, they they've got to take that into account. Um, but like I said, looking I feel... at Treyarch, look, just looking at Treyarch's history of not listening to the community, they might also just not do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like in in Milo's video, he he pointed out that like it kind of opens your eyes to zombies, as in like the last ten years, everyone's <laughs> looked at it as. The, the thing that's keeping Treyarch on the map and the thing that's literally making them money, blah, 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 blah. When in reality, it's a game mode within a game within a corporation the size of Activision. It, it, it's actually just such a small chunk of what Activision is doing. Um, and I, I don't know, I feel like that is, that, that's finally hit the community in the face and it's like, well, yeah, it is just a game mode in a game. Uh, that's probably played by like a low percentage of the players on the game. Uh, again, though, Black Ops Three wouldn't have been that way. I feel like there was a nice balance between multiplayer and zombies on Black Ops Three, just because Black Ops Three is the best game for zombies ever. Um, and then Blackout had to come in and ruin everything. See, oh, I, don't know, I can't agree with you on that, man. I, I like Blackout. Um, well, I don't. I, I, I have, don't like that all. Yeah, well. I, I have fun with Blackout, but. I can understand what you're saying completely. I do like, feel I'd like... like to see player per percentages once, just to see yeah. if Blackout is really worth it putting so many developers I, in. I honestly think a solid 85% of Black Ops 4's play, uh, fan base are playing multiplayer. Like, solid 85%. Multiplayer is great. Multiplayer is the one thing that I actually enjoyed on Black Ops 4. See, I still enjoy it. I was on with a few friends last night. I am absolutely... Cr like, uh, uh, PG word... Uh, I am absolutely do do at it, right? But <laughs> I enjoy it, and it uh, it does feel like an old COD game still. Um, there's a lot of sweats online now, but Christmas noobs have also just came in, and it's it's great. It's still a great great game to play. Uh, Blackout, like I said, I enjoy it with like a squad of four just to mess around. I I, I couldn't play Blackout solo, like I, it bores me. For for solo battle royale, Fortnite is where it's at. Uh, straight up, I love Fortnite again. I I, I know Semi's just edging to to stab a knife <laughs> through me. And, and <laughs> cut my spleen to pieces. But no, Fortnite is a great game. Okay, it, it is a great game. Um, I have no comments. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure you got no yeah. comments. Um, and yeah, zombies. Zombies is just well. <laughs> so I, I mean, if you go down to the gaming section of the Discord, you can see that Fortnite VC is still called shit game VC. The, wait, there was a Nobody <laughs> who made Fortnite VC. Someone made it, and oh, I just really think that was me. Game VC. <laughs> so, so Sammy, the big question is, which do you hate more, CS:GO or Fortnite? I have to say Fortnite. Like CS:GO is still like, mm, it it hasn't stealed TF2 shit. Let's just keep it at that. Because okay, of course they're they're the same company as TF2, so they're not allowed <laughs> to do that. <laughs> Hold on a minute. So that you're saying that you don't mind them because they haven't stole TF2. Are you implying that Fortnite has stole something from TF2 or 
Yes, some of the dances are literal copies. Wait, are you being serious? Yes, I've watched the video on it. I used to love TF2 and I Loki haven't seen no similarities. Um, hang on, hang on, let me look at it. I played TF2 once and I was absolutely terrible at it, so I haven't played it since. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I, I respect it, man. It, it's an old game, TF2 is right, but it was probably the... F Second game I played fully on my, like, by the my way, old laptop. By the way, before I get like a thousand comments saying, yeah, they're just dances that are real life dances. Some of them are direct copies of things that TF2 originally created. Wait, really? Yes. Like, I know Fortnite are, are known for, for using other games, such as like the new skin that came out is an amazing skin, but straight up that's Mercy from Overwatch. Like, straight up. A, that is Mercy from Overwatch. Tweet. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going back to Fortnite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, straight up, that's Mercy from Overwatch. Uh, another example would be, I don't know, in a different way, the gnome. That is a meme. They've literally taken a meme and put it in as a skin. And I, I don't know, I like that skin, but again, it, it isn't original. Um, but then again, what is original? So, so Sam, do you, do, you, do you know which uh, emotes then have been mm -hmm. robbed? What 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 are the emotes then that have been robbed from? Well, Fortnite? just look at pocket pocket discussion. Look at what? Sorry, podcast the discussion. Pocket. Yeah, I, I I know my Robix. Like I know that. I know it's a real life dance, but still, <laughs> Overwatch has also done it, and people were mad about that. Wait, let me see if I can bring this up onto. Uh, onto the screen. I don't know if I can do this right. Uh, window capture. Uh, podcast discussion Discord. Yep. Yeah, okay. There we go. And it covered my face. Yay. Right. Okay. If I put that there, and then I move across a bit. Right. Okay. How long is it? I'm not hey guys, that. what's going on? My it's name like is Joe, and welcome to a brand new video. Wait, is so all of these? Okay, so okay, okay, okay. Fair enough, right? It stole the cossacking. The, the cossacking, straight up, fair play. But I, uh, I don't know, really. Let's have a look. Oh my god, I see what you mean! <laughs> yeah, and yeah. the fresh from Fortnite. But like, there are some in here that I'm, I'm pretty on. sure, don't quote me on this, but I'm pretty sure TF2 originally created some of these. Really? And then, then, then they've just taken it. I'm honestly yeah. surprised that, that they haven't received no, like, backlash from, from doing certain things, Fortnite, man. They're, they're, I, don't, I, don't know, I don't know, they're literally... The biggest game in the world right now, but you, uh, you know they're being sued, right? Yeah, yeah, by literally sued. everyone. Like, more they're being sued yeah. by like dance created, like the guy behind. What, what's it? What's that stupid <laughs> cringy dance <laughs> called again? Kid. <laughs> the backpack like, the, kid. Yeah, the, 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 the thing everyone does. <laughs> that guy, his his mom and his manager are suing them. Like why? Yeah, but like the video, the game, the game theory did just like proves that he's probably gonna lose. But there is mm -hmm. one dance that they did that could get them like really in trouble if the guys was, used it. Was it the Carlton dance? Yeah, I know. Oh, I don't that. that. But surely he didn't create it. Surely it was the people of Fresh Prince that created it. Mm. Well, the joke is that the TF2 has had the Carlton dance in it for years, and they haven't been sued. They probably asked permission anyway. Oh yeah, that's probably what Fortnite did. I like Loki. Yeah, but mm, I don't know. If they've done so many things, it's, so many people are suing them for them. I don't think they. It's it unreal, permission. isn't it? Really, like uh, how many people are saying, "Yep, it, I'm going to sue Fortnite." Yep. It's unreal, <laughs> unreal, uh, unreal. Is what, there. <laughs> what the engine is called. <coughs> I just <laughs> have to pull it out. <laughs> that's, 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 that's good. That's good. But now I. Uh, I don't know. I respect them for what they've done, but like you say, at the same time, they should probably ask for permissions, um, just to just to keep everyone happy. And they've, they've, I think the reason they didn't ask for permission is because they don't want to pay royalties or something like that. Yeah, probably. Um, 
I mean, it's like my sister made a point yesterday, and I had to laugh. She said that, like, Fortnite was Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> Minecraft 2, and I was like, have you ever seen Fortnite? <laughs> it's literally well, a let's different see. game you, mode. You have these um, giant disco ball hammers that you smash trees with for some reason <laughs> and then get wood out of it. And you build fences with it. That's I, I like pretty Minecrafty to me. I like the little ode there to uh, to, to my boyfriend cops. I like that same. Thanks. No, that's like every time the only thing, the only like experience you four and a half is watching you. <laughs> <laughs> well, Honestly, you should let. Wow, wow, <laughs> taking shots here. Okay, now, <laughs> now, honestly, right? You should, you should. Have you ever played it? What? Have you ever you, played it? Fortnite? No. You should honestly download no, it. No, I do. Yes, have you should. Epic. For some reason, I do have the epic you launch on my computer. You should download it, right, and no, play cross-platform with me for a stream. Honestly, right, that would be a that would be a funny stream. Oh my god. That'd be a great time. We'd have a laugh. Why? Because you'd be playing on PC and you'd be the worst in the lobby. That doesn't add up in Fortnite terms. PC I'd are meant to be like... just like kill myself over and over. Whoa, Sam! Don't fall <laughs> off that mountain! <laughs> <laughs> oh, anyway, like, um... I swear my PC is going to kill itself when it sees Fortnite on it. <laughs> Can you imagine? I'm not running that. No, no, I'm not running that. <laughs> Press it again and I will turn off. <laughs> <laughs> but like the amount of shite fucking oh I was gonna I was gonna launch the epic launcher to see how much shite Fortnite brings to it, but it's it has to update. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't launched this in like months. <laughs> or actually weeks. So, so hold on, why do you have the epic launcher if you don't like Fortnite? Because I'm I'm learning C++ with the Unreal Engine, and you oh. have to have the Epic Launcher to install the Unreal Engine. Oh, it's so stupid. Wait, so Epic have bought Unreal then? Because wasn't the, un they? Oh, they made Unreal. Oh, really? Yes. That, see, that's interesting because I don't know if you guys remember. Right, we're going we're going some some time back now to Five Nights at Freddy's. There was a RPG spin-off game made and Markiplier played it and he got drunk whilst he played it. I don't know if you guys remember it. Um, if you've either of you have ever watched Mark, um, he he did like a series on it where he he'd take a shot every episode, uh, but obviously he'd record the whole episode, like whole thing in one day. So he, by the last episode, he was completely slaughtered. Um, but yeah, anyway, uh, <laughs> it was a game that was made on Unreal. Um, so that technically ties in with the the old Fortnite made everything thing doesn't it well no not the Fortnite made everything stupid the uh epic games launcher made a lot of games that you don't even realize about like so i i i your gone your internet is really stupid right now like why you're, you're cutting like, off a lot in and out, just like we can hear like parts of what you're saying <sighs> Thanks, thanks, Richard Branson. Cheers, but, mate. All right, just what, what you what did you what you were saying? I, I just want to point out, have you guys ever heard of Galgon? Galgon, no, no. It's 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 an anime game where you like, where every every girl in in, in the game falls in love with you, and you have to give them like, uh, euphoria. I yeah, think yeah, it's, it's it sounds great. That does sound. Yeah, yeah, go on. <laughs> make, make the you, know who made, you know who made? You know, you know <laughs> who made that game? Would it be Unreal? It's epic. See... Unreal is the engine, not the fucking company. <laughs> Alright, stop bullying me. Uh, no, I've noticed if you Google Epic Games, they've actually made so many games before Fortnite. It's actually so, Unreal. Like, oh, I didn't realise they made Gears of War. Yeah, part. yeah. I never realised that until I watched Nick Merckx and he was on about it and I was like, oh, well. Yeah. It's, it's I'm just on the store right now. I see a, I see a lot of games I don't recognize, but also a lot of games that I have heard of. Mm -hmm. Like Subnautica, I see a lot of friends play that game. Wait, they made Subnautica? No, it's on their store apparently. I don't think they made oh, it. Oh, I was gonna well, say. They, they might have made it. Oh wait, actually. It's, it, it, no, wait, Unknown Worlds made it. I think it's just like on their launcher. Mm. 
Well, it's like um, Battle.net. Battle they, 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 that's got COD on it now, but they didn't make COD. Uh, Battle.net is like from Blizzard, and Blizzard is working with... Activision, yeah, yeah, obviously, yeah. Yeah, yeah, they, they worked on this They've one. also got Destiny on there. Mm. Or, yeah, uh, didn't yeah, Destiny Dest lose its, like, developers in the week or something? Yeah, no, yeah. Destiny is, like, going um, solo, the developers. The developers have left, but Activision yeah. have kept the rights to Destiny, so then no, Destiny's they're... got new developers, hasn't it? No, no, no. They're, they're working on on transferring the rights to the makers of Destiny. Oh, wow, wow. So separate from uh, yeah. Activision. Ah, fair it's, enough. Yeah, Bungie is their name. Yeah, they're they're working on like. See a lot of Luna. a lot of zombies YouTubers were tweeting about it, saying it's like big. Uh, for did you not for see zombies. Milo's video? On yeah, it? yeah, I did, and that's what I'm saying. I, I haven't seen the video. I haven't clicked on it. But like, why? Why is it such a big thing for zombie because fans? I don't get it. It's it's it 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 it. Bleh. <laughs> <laughs> it just gives us a chance to believe that Treyarch might be able to do the same thing, get the rights for the zombies game, and just make their own standalone zombies game. Oh wow! Well, that's outside of Activision, without microtransactions, with my probably with, but like without Activision interfering. Well, with yeah, it. you'd have the gobble gum system, wouldn't you? Let's be honest. If if there was a if there was a, a a zombie standalone game, right, and you can only pick five maps on the disc to start with, what maps would you pick? Let's oh. see. Origins. Yeah. Mal to death. No. Yeah. Drive yeah. and drag. Yes. Ah, uh, wait, two more, two more, two more, two more, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, sure, and then Call of the Dead. Call of the Dead? That's one of my favorite maps. Alright, Lex, I'm sorry to say it, but I wouldn't put Call of the Dead on the map. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, miss me and with I that Call of the Dead By stuff. the way, I say, I say that still because I sickled George to death. I don't know why I was so fun. What, what, so fun. Why did you do that? Why on earth because did a friend you stab of mine the guy told to me death? A friend of mine told me there was an achievement with that, but I, I, I did that. I, like, I just got disappointed. Was there actually an achievement? No, there wasn't. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And also because Call of Duty is like the f it's, it's the first map where you, there's a solo Easter egg. Well, yeah, uh, I guess, yeah, yeah. That's, that's there's also point. like th there's also the um, there's also a separate achievement for that. It yeah. has one of the best ever um, character interactions with each other ever. Um, Rick Tuffin, that's not a handle. That <laughs> <laughs> that's not a power switch, Rick Tuffin. <laughs> Uh, oh man, I love it. I love. It. I the do love Call of the Dead. This it is the step where you give map. Nikolai his vodka. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then like, don't don't Dempsey and Nikolai start dancing together and drinking. And... <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh man, it's great. It is great. The character interactions is. Um, but no, I don't. I, no, I'd, I'd have to put Kino on it. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, I I think Kino is a great map, but this. Uh, I've played this. I've overplayed it so much. It's become so boring. I, I'm literally streaming it later tonight. I love that map so much. Like I can't play. I Black Ops Three, you know, maybe because it's still new. But like Black Ops One, you know, I've become so tired of it. See, I haven't touched Black Ops One, you know, in months just because I can't record like last gen yet. Um, but so yeah. when are you getting your PC? <laughs> Well, <laughs> this is what you need Xbox One. Uh, I'm looking. Oh yeah, that uh, too, yes. It's a good point. Um, now I'm I'm looking at getting it for my birthday, so that's what April. So. What's your budget? I still need to know because I want to look. I want to pick something for you. Uh, let me just do a quick conversion. I'll even convert it to euros for you. How about that, Sam? That does that help you at all? Ben. Yo. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Ben, I'm doing it on Amazon, so you don't need right, to do right, it. Right. I've already converted it around 730 euros, something like that. Just give me the pounds. I don't even remember the pounds. Jesus Christ. Stop. Christ. No. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, uh, actually, a big question for the the um, standalone zombies game. Would you have gobblegums? Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Why? Because gobblegums are like they've become such a staple of Black Ops Three. Yes. I just think there should be like an option. Um. I know. I actually know. Mm. 
they're like a, a leaderboards thing where they're like um you've used cobble gums or you haven't used cobble gums like just yeah, just yeah. like how zombie leaderboards does it but like their own leaderboards see and that's another Assu thing assuming they assuming that they fixed the, the hacker the just the hacker thing mm, mm. like they need better anti-hack shit they <laughs> really need it now nah, honestly i was playing uh rush earlier i was playing rush earlier on nine and i think i've how it, I've, how 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 even is rush i've never i played. love rush it's actually so much fun like I, I don't know why it's like an arcade game like you, you stick a pound in and you play on the arcade game try and get a high school it, it's literally like that and it's it's great um, it's, it's it sounds like <laughs> it's a bit dead like ops. dead ops it is a bit like dead ops to be fair with you um <laughs> I was playing earlier and I got like a decent score. I think it was like seven hundred odd thousand. And I was looking. I was. I was hoping to look on the worldwide leaderboards. I didn't know they still didn't exist on zombies. Like there's still no worldwide leaderboards on Black Ops Four zombies. And, and we they've what? also like the last what? update they did. They, they, Four they're months still, after launch. They're still saying that they're going to have new. That the, 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 later on they're going to have news about mastery camos. Yeah, yeah. They, they, again, yeah. Dark like, Matter's meant to be coming out this Tuesday, but I, I, I've got a feeling they might not give it to us. Like, I, I, I still feel like they have. They need to put in zombies mastery camos. Like, there was this time when I was like, I'm going to unlock every camo and every weapon, but now I'm like, I have stopped playing Black Ops Four. Why do I even bother? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was more motivated, right, to unlock Red Hex on every gun on Black Ops Three. Yeah, but that's I was... because Red Hex was like. Red and Black Hex was Three. so good. <laughs> like, it was so easy. It was easy, but it was also f like if a you, good if, looking skin. If you go in Black in Black Ops Three, I unlocked every single weapon uh, to its highest level, and like it was like level six on every weapon when I unlocked Red Hex. It was so low. Mm. I, honestly, though, I did enjoy it. I, did, I, I, lo I loved the skin Red Hex. I feel like it was a really nice skin. I, I feel like it was better than any Black Ops Four skin. I, honestly, I feel like Black Ops Four is doing it better with the weapon kits, though. Like in Black Ops Three, you could just—it was just like every single weapon on the weapon kits. It's in every single map, and now they've got the Tommy gun <laughs> in the weapon kits. Mm. Mm. <clears throat> and they, they'll probably do like more in future DLCs, but probably not. <laughs> Probably, but probably not. <laughs> I, I reckon they'll add that SWAT AR, the one that's been added to multiplayer on Blackout. I reckon that'll be in the next zombies map. I, I, I I, it's a very good gun. It is ridiculous. Um, you know, you know, there is one thing like there, there is one thing people have been complaining about, and it's like car points. You cannot do any apart from like elixirs. Yeah. There's nothing in zombies if you're a no, solo player. No, that's yeah. No, that's, that brings me to another point. Solo players. Oh, God. <laughs> Hello. Why? Why do you hate us, Treyarch? <laughs> <laughs> like, literally. No, no. <laughs> I hate solo players this year, and it makes no sense. Like, why? <laughs> Semi. I, I, I've tried Blood of the Dead so many I, times. I was going to say to you right now, you're a good player at Zombies. Have you completed a black ops 4 easter egg solo yet no exactly no. have exactly. i completed any easter egg yet even if uh, even if co-op no i haven't because co-op but blood of the dead is impossible solo or co-op seriously isn't like, it that people... step with a bird yes <laughs> no i swear to god the last time i tried it i just like i i wasted so many elixirs and the bird was just glitched out i it, it was it didn't exist <laughs> Like I was on the blood on, on the zombie blood step where mm -hmm. you have to uh, like shield blast it in zombie blood. Oh, no wait, no uh, tomahawk it. Mm -hmm. And I kept hearing the bird, but it was like in a wall or something. I couldn't. I I, I, I searched the entire area. It was it just didn't exist. I, I remember the big Easter egg hunt for it, and I think that was the last time the zombies community peaked. Like everyone yeah. was streaming to find that second step. And honestly, <coughs> I will always say it. The day before it was found, the last game me and Tom were playing, Tom had the idea, and I, I give him full credit, to run a Brutus around the map when he was slamming, just to see if he interacted with anything. Swear to God. So we would have probably found that second step, but... You didn't use a spoon, though, so... <laughs> we died. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just straight up, it's, yeah, it's over. But now, I don't know, I think that, that was the last time the Zombies community peaked, like... Dead of the Night, I, I, I didn't even, I don't think, I, I think I'd played the map once by the time the egg was solved. 
I've so, played Dead or Night two times. I, I, again, I like it, but I just I feel I think like they, they ruined the it night, with the marketing. Like, Dead of the Night also like... D Jesus Christ, Pack-a-Punch feels like an easter egg. <laughs> yeah, it does actually, Jesus yeah. Jesus Christ. I, I, when was it I that I streamed it? I streamed it like a few weeks back and I, I feel the exact same way. Like, the chat had to help me so much to do Pack-a-Punch and I'm like, why? Transit's pack a punch was easier than this. Like why? <laughs> no, Loki. Transit's pack a punch. Everyone keeps complaining about it. It's so easy if you just have it patience. Mm -hmm. There's so much shit in the zombies that's so easy if you have patience, and nobody understands that. I had like, I had a discussion with someone on Reddit, and like everyone downvoted my po my my post because <laughs> they didn't like me. Oh god. <laughs> because it's like, let's go to origins for a sec. Origins. The robot step. If you just have patience, leave a zombie, then it's going to be all right. But if you play like you, Ben, <laughs> sorry. Wow, but wow. If you okay. just like, okay, no, no, no. So I have this friend. I can understand um, it though. I, I play zombies uh, fast. I play it aggressively. I want to just like, advance. I want it ideally, there and then. I don't want ideally it. An or, ten ideally, in Origins, what you want to do is have every staff upgraded by round nine. And have the fists by before. Semi, I don't have 18. my ice staff upgraded by nine. Can you you stop bullying me? <laughs> <laughs> nah, it depends. If I get good RNG, I will get round three and five snow. Then yeah, hundred percent is done. But, but like yeah, but like the first time I did the Easter egg, and I did exactly that. And it's like we were doing, we were being so slow about it, so so play, <laughs> so slow paced, and it still worked. Honestly, like, I want to try the Origins Easter egg, man. But like, I, I don't you, feel like I could do it. When I get my PS4, I just buy. I'll just buy Chronicles. I, I honestly, you've got to play Garod Krovi first before you even <laughs> agree. No, oh, no, dude, dude <laughs> Garod defeated me. Like I said last night, it literally cut my spleen into a million pieces. <laughs> it, it hurt me. Garod did because I was on a, I was on a roll. I did DE first attempt, Zetsubo second attempt in the same stream. And God now he's gonna Krovy. do Gorkrovy third attempt. For the seventh attempt, I'm probably still gonna fail with those stupid <laughs> trophy steps. Even though the trophies, like whatever they're called, challenges, is literally like 80% of the Easter egg. Uh, oh man, I just hate it. Nemo, get out of here. You're, I, you're I just a want silly to know, drone. What, 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 remember on my stream when I was like, Ben, uh, guess what step I'm on? And what, what were you thinking at the time? No, like I when I what, what, when I had completed when I had completed all all trophies. Uh. Oh, no, no, it was on the mangler step, like the uh, the, the the aggressive manglers at the pack a punch. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I, I was like Ben, what step? Guess what step am I on? You were like in the chat, something like you were raging or something. I, I thought. I, what, I think what, I'm what were you sure, thinking? Yeah. Of I don't know, I just I, I can't do Garod. I find it too hard. <laughs> After about round thirty. It just gets ridiculous. <laughs> I've helped a, I've helped a lot of people with Garrod Grovey. I don't like, even... oh, what's my I, I, round? I, don't I know it comes from is, someone who I I know it comes from someone who has twenty shopping frees and twenty five workaholics, but <laughs> <laughs> probably like, helps. No, yeah, like uh, but I've done it. I, I've nearly done it without gobblegums. Give me a break. Dude, you survived longer in the boss fight with no perks than I'd have survived with <laughs> perks. Like, I think the first time I did it, I, I think, I, I think the first time I did it, I downed with aftertaste. Like on my, on my like first attempt, that was like <coughs> a, w a week before Revelations came out for PC. <laughs> I think, or was it? I don't know if it already came out for like everyone for, for Dude, PlayStation. No, or I only... remember Revelations is released, man, on like, the day it released. I know, I, I know, I did grow up before Revelations got released on PC. I know that for sure. I had, I had my first video hit like over a thousand views overnight. I thought I was gonna go viral. Like, <laughs> you know, what, you know, you know what video it was. Though? That's the best part. Uh, Apothecary uh... servant gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> it was just me running around in the spawn room with the apothecary just shooting it like oh, so guys this is the gameplay well i wasn't like that it was more like so guys this is the gameplay of the apothecary <laughs> servant uh my, it's a great my, weapon overpowered uh, I, 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 I cringe looking back at it but it's not as bad as the second video i made how to get jugged by round two <laughs> and again that got a few thousand views i'm like hell yeah man this is this is good at, the, at this point in time my most popular video is still a fucking pokemon platinum randomizer 
at three and a half thousand views. You know, I always say that when I'm when, when you've edited a video and I'm giving you credit, so I'm going to get your channel because your Twitter's still blocked. <laughs> I see, I see the Pokemon randomizer thing, and I've never clicked on it. But you know what? I'm gonna click on it after this this this, this podcast. <laughs> I'm gonna see what it's all about. It's probably so cringy. Like my commentary sucks. Dude, welcome to the world of commentary. My commentary. Have sucks. you ever? Have you ever seen my dead end gun scene? I, like yes, it, it, yes, I think I've seen that. It's got 800 views. Yeah, I, I probably I, have. I, I'm, I'm still not proud of it. Like it's, it's. Uh, if you compare, like I was trying to like be like, like uh, my my um, what do, you, what do you call that? Like my my uh, idol or something? I don't know. The guy I look up to is like game that three to one. The guy who did. It's not all like, it's, 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 Inspiration, your inspiration. Yeah, inspiration. Oh, my yeah. inspiration is game that three to one, and he's like super good at it. And I'm like, um, yeah, I can not do that, but I'll try. And that, that's where the dead edit cutscene came from. <laughs> <laughs> and then like, I, I I had zero motivation, but I wanted to do Paradolia after that. Like that's my favorite song. Mm -hmm. But then like, um, I had I started on it and like. Here we are, but <laughs> the only other gun thing I've ever done after I just stopped it is like bone tr bone trousel from Undertale because some guy did it with CSGO and I was like, this sucks. I I can do way better than this by just copy pasting <laughs> everything. So I made it in like t in like one hour. Oh my god, how how can you make a gun sink in an hour? That's, that's by ridiculous. copy pasting everything. Well, okay. it's like in. Well, Bone Trials is like one beat. Copy and paste and everything. So, Sam, how did those assignments go to, uh, at school? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it took me to like half past 12. Oh, the day and before, I wasn't, I'll I was, forget that. I wasn't even happy with them, but still. And like, we were like, we're in a class of like six people. And, <laughs> and like, we were all on WhatsApp, like, um, sharing information about it because we all, it's like a, um, uh, it was a report on like a uh, what do you call it in English? Fuck. <laughs> an assignment. Uh, uh, like a practical assignment or something. Practical in England is yeah. when you like do something practically. <laughs> <laughs> like you actually do it. Like say in, in IT, if if we're actually fixing a computer, that'd be a practical. Yeah, yeah, that. Like we we had to do stuff like that with food it's like a science class or a, a chemistry class or something it's, it's not really not chemistry but like cooking class or it's, no no it's like it's it's a class with, <laughs> with different topics every quarter mm. and this this quarter was like cooking and, and chemistry did you bring <laughs> up dr monty's factory no i did not <laughs> because nobody would understand it so yeah but uncultured people I'm <laughs> but yeah there, there was like uh we were all like uh sharing information because we had to do that mm. and everyone was like oh we have to also make some assignments uh <laughs> is anyone gonna do them let's just not do them <laughs> and then if the te oh wait no actually fuck i shouldn't be saying this if my teacher is watching this by any chance okay i'm not gonna say that <laughs> Wait, no, no, I don't think your teacher's going to be watching the BPG podcast. <laughs> right, it where, where, where? It's a small world, all right. Uh, <laughs> um, I don't know. I, I think... You know, I think... One last question, right. <laughs> One last question. One last question. If if Treyarch were to make... If, if Treyarch were to get the rights and they were to make this, this standalone zombies game... Do you think it would be mainly mainly based off, and, and this goes to the people who've watched all the way through as well, leave a comment. Um, do you think it would be based purely on remastered maps, or do you think they'd make new maps for the game consistently for a few years, at least? I, I think I they'll make new maps. I'm going to say they'd be a mix of both. Oh, see, that's how I feel. I think it'd be a mix of both, because uh, remasters are for the fan service. Everyone loves remasters, whereas like new maps are... Shadows of Evil was a new map, okay. Uh, and honestly, I think it's the best launch map ever. Um, pe like period, because it started Black Ops Three. But uh, yeah, I think uh, I think that's good. That would be good. So uh, 
But uh, wait, 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 what you just said, like people who are going to watch it all the way through. There are also people who skip to the end for these, ki yeah. for, for these <laughs> kind of messages. Um, if you've skipped it, you're an asshole. Go back. Uh, <laughs> if you've like if, <laughs> the best place to put these kind of messages is like in the middle. Yeah, of the yeah, video. yeah. Just like thirty minutes in or something like that. Like Mr. Beast did that, didn't he? When he uh, did the same PewDiePie hundred thousand times, he, he he did a load of random stuff in between it. Um, but yeah, the, uh, crap. Right. Okay, let me just ring Keemstar and ask him how to end the podcast. Um, <laughs> no, I don't know. Uh, yeah, man. I thank you. I thank you too for coming out. It's been a it's been a good. Uh, how long is it? I don't even know. Hour ish, something like that. It's been a good. Uh, Good first episode, I think. I think it, well, I think it's better than the other first two episodes that are now private on the channel and they will never ever surface again. Um, <laughs> shout out to Nathan for not making it. Uh, <laughs> 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 nah, seriously, thanks for watching. Um, I've been Ben Plays Games. That has been uh, Laxar and Nathan Two. Why are you still calling me Laxar? Why are you still calling me Nathan Two? I've, I've like <laughs> given up on that name. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, 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 I guess I'll see you all later, man. It just meme turned in, it just turned into me <laughs> movie. Oh no, 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 no. Oh god. Bye bye. <laughs>